Hi, how are you? This is a mod that we are going to play today. Uh, bye. Hi, how are you? This is Water Balloon. We're playing The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. I'm sorry about the crappy intro. That's just how things work here. Uh, you guys know how mod spotlights work, and if you don't, we'll explain here shortly. We're going to random a character. We're Isaac. For once in my freaking life. What a time to be alive. Uh, to start, we are going to spawn in Water Balloon. Which is right here. Would you look at that if I can spell balloon properly? Uh, and what this does is we throw water balloons that then explode into other tiers. It's pretty cool. Honestly, I like it a decent amount. Here's to see it if you want to play it along. 362V34QB. We also have the fly counter mod on. Uh, and we're having a good time, having a good time, we're having a ball. Uh, if you don't know the rules of how I do mod spotlights, I'm allowed to take either the first item room or the second item room, but not both. It's just a way to balance the fact that we spawn in uh, an item that is normally pretty good, uh, since it is a fun modded item. I do know that Water Balloon has some synergies, so of course you already know. We're going to be looking to uh, try out some of those, and if we don't find a bunch of fun synergies, then at the end of the video, we will absolutely go back and uh, spawn in some synergies and see exactly what Water Balloon can do, and you guys can see whether or not this is a mod that is worth it for you to go download uh, and play along with on your own save file. That's how we do things here in the land of the snakes. I don't know. Uh, let's not go to the shop. We are going to go to our secret room, though, which is right here. And then we're going to promptly walk out of it because it was trash. Uh, give me one second. I'm like, <laughs> my earbuds are choking me a little bit. Okay, hold on. My earbuds are choking me a little bit. Okay, let me just untie you. You know how this goes. Earbuds get caught in knots. People are probably like, you freaking wear earbuds when you record. There we go. That is so much better. You freaking wear earbuds when you record. Yeah, I don't have fancy headset crap. I have a bad microphone that sits on my desk. And then I have some, you know, like $6 earbuds that I bought at a Best Buy six years ago. People are like, wow, such quality. <laughs> I'm like, I know. I'm with you. Do we want that? I don't really want that. Um... I'm going to take that as a sign that we should just take the next item room. And I'm going to use my reroll probably on the boss item if it's bad. And then we'll just do the item room on the next floor and uh, everything works out. A.O. freaking K. I would really like, actually, though, to not, um, not, I would like to not, basically. I would like to not get hit on this fight because I really would prefer to have... Uh, this extra red heart that we got right now. So if you can mind just screwing off Ragman, that would be absolutely phenomenal. And screw off you did. Thank you, my good friend. We will take Jesus Juice. It's a small damage up. Uh, and yeah, let's head down. I have no idea how people wear necklaces that choke them. I've just had my freaking earbuds around me. I literally feel like a free man after removing those earbuds from like around my neck and it's not like I was sitting here in a chokehold because of these earbuds it was just like you know the wire was a little tight is all I don't know how people wear those choker necks why are those even a thing do people actually think those look good maybe I'm now like just showing my opinion too much in this video but those actually like look really bad People are going to be like, oh, but my girlfriend wears a choker necklace and she's hot. And I'm like, okay, thanks, little Jimmy, who's 12 and doesn't actually have a girlfriend. Uh, your input really was what I needed on this situation. I appreciate that a ton. Being a little bit facetious, but I also like those necklaces are really stupid. And luckily, I got a beautiful, lovely girlfriend that agrees with me. I would love to find our item room pretty much now, though. Um... We need a little bit more. This balloon has potential. I will say that. This was one of the most popular items on the workshop for a while. Uh, so I'm excited to still see more of this. But we either need a dope tears upgrade or we need a dope, uh, like, synergy or something. Something that scares the crap out of me is something like Ipecac with this. 
Uh, and it's... Oh, there's the deal with the Devil Chance. I knew it was going to happen, too. Uh, it was only a matter of time. But I would love to get something like Epicac. It scares the crap out of me, but it'd be a ton of fun. Let me just tell you that. Uh, because it would result in a lot of explosions everywhere. And in case you're unaware, I do enjoy explosions everywhere. I do want to also just go back and find this item room. I feel like it's going to be the right... Can you please be... Oh, okay. Good, thank you. Life is a beautiful sunshine and roses. I did get hit again right there. I don't know what this is. It's Sister Maggie. Do I want that shield plate now? Yeah, I do. Because that's real bad. Uh, we are going to use our bomb to get in here. Because I want that golden poop. So pretty please just allow me to crack you open. 13 cents is not quite enough for the shop, but uh, a future shop, absolutely. And now just like, don't get this deal with the devil because you don't deserve it. I mean, I would love it, but you're not going to get it, so don't expect it. Only a 35% chance means not likely to receive. They always say, ask and you shall receive. Not in this case. I'm probably not going to get it. I'm asking for it. But we're probably not going to get it. Uh, and that's okay. Honestly, we got time to get more deals. That's going to be a lovely life. We didn't get it. Instead, we get Blood Clot, which is just okay. And then we're going to head down. So next floor, the goal is to not get hit. As for we get our deal with the devil. He moved the wrong way. Okay, this blood clot water balloon is real sketch, honestly, but I love every second of it. We will pick up the Book of Sin, get a card from it, which is another Wheel of Fortune, and then we'll reroll that into Shard of Glass, which inflicts bleed damage or something like that. I don't necessarily think this was the greatest uh, item we could have gotten here, but you know what? It's an item. Hard for me to sit here and complain. If we get a bomb... Uh, I may go back and just spawn, well, wherever we want to use the bomb, I'll just go back and grab that other Wheel of Fortune, and we'll just blow all this crap up together. Thought I had it blown up, but I guess I didn't. This friggin' black cloud still follows me around. It's a game called something something. I don't remember the lyrics to Eminem's magnum opus, Lose Yourself. Is that Lose Yourself? Thought I had it mapped out, but I guess I didn't. Yeah, that's, that, that has to be Lose Yourself. Maybe I'm losing it. Maybe I'm losing myself in the music, the moment you want it. Never ever let it go. Let's go into our shop. Uh, okay, I said let's go into our shop, though. Thank you. Deep Pockets is splendid. I'm going to buy this bomb. Uh, and then... I know we're going to get a use out of it. I just don't know where yet. We could try to guess Secret Room. We could also just wait for the arrival of not an addicted pill. We could wait for the arrival of a tinted rock. But so far, uh, can't deny, my hips don't lie, and we haven't found tinted rock yet on this run. So, can't really say that I'm expecting to get one here right now. Right here, right now. Na 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 na. I don't know the lyrics to any song that I ever sing. Okay, Wheel of Fortune. Throw down a bomb. Bing, bang, boom, Mr. Worldwide is a step in the room. A lot of money. A key. I know that we uh, didn't grab the other Wheel of Fortune, but frankly, at this point, uh, I would like to get the hell out of this floor and hopefully get a deal with the devil that I don't deserve. And then hopefully get, like, a stat upgrade that isn't trash. Little Chad. I mean, we're going to re-roll whatever he gives us, which is going to be Little Chad. Um, and hopefully that'll turn into a good item. You know, we, we still have the slightest hope that we get a deal with the devil here. And that deal contains, like, brimstone or something, so we can get some dope synergies going. I, I feel like you almost, well, there goes the deal with the devil chance. Freaking 1%. Who's got uh, the odds on this one, huh? If I get the deal, y'all owe me $200 and supporting contributions to the channel i'm not allowed to say donation anymore that's not how that works okay oh like our damage is really bad though 
water balloon, you need to pick it up a little bit, okay? Give me a tears upgrade. That's all we need, okay? No deal. Tears upgrade. What a time to be alive. Okay. I feel ten times more powerful at this stage of the game. Let's head down. Still no deals, but we're making progress. Am I right? Am I right? I'm right. Don't even tell me I'm wrong. I know I'm right. Uh, we will never hit this guy. So that's good. Are we going to have Sister Maggie deal all the damage to uh, Lust here? I don't want him to. We got a couple hits in there. Couple hits. Couple hits. Do we got to get you really close? Is that the ticket? I don't think that's the ticket though. Oh, you got close to me there, buddy. Buddy pal. I'm not your buddy pal. I'm not your pal buddy. Okay, though. You need... There we go. Gave me the virus. I am going to take it. I think the virus is okay. The virus is also a speed downgrade. Who knew? I definitely didn't. Uh, I, I feel like I remember saying in a previous video, Oh, wow. The virus is a speed downgrade. So I suppose I did know. Just kind of forgot... We still haven't gotten hit on this floor, despite having two of the worst rooms in the history of rooms in Isaac. Um, I will survive. We, we basically, we need this deal with the devil, or else we're going to be in a crappy spot on this run. I mean, even if you start giving me deals with the angel, I'd be happy. Why did you do this? You're not allowed to have enemies right as I walk into the frigged up room. Good talk. Uh, I do see that tinted rock. And for the first time in forever, I would really love to have a bomb. It's not the first time. You know, I'm tired of these enemies all over my friggin' grill. You didn't even give me a spirit heart. Oh, it's one of those runs, boys. It's Mod Spotlight that wants me to die. And I don't appreciate it in the freaking slightest right now. For the love of Buddha. Allow me to get a deal with the devil on this run. I know I'm not going to get one now either. What do we got in here? Common cold? It's like just okay. Um, Yeah, it's good enough. And hopefully it just shoves out a bunch of poison tears. And that would be beautiful. Uh, I would really appreciate it if we actually got these things taken care of like ASAP. The poops. Okay, good talk. Allow me to get actually get here, though. We can't get that bomb. I've never felt more upset in my life. I'm kidding. I don't really give a damn. Uh, we only need one bomb until we need two. That's what the wise old man always said. You never need two of something. Unless you're getting married, then you do need two rings. But I suppose if you're starting a freaking curling team, you're going to need more than two people. You need two people to do the broom sweepy thing. You need another person to throw the damn rock. How does that work exactly? Okay, I know I've watched Olympic curling in the past. It's my favorite pastime watching uh, the National Curling League. But also, like, do the broom guys, do they get the medal too? Because they do just as much work as the guy throwing the thing. Are they a team? Or is it, like, individuals doing it? These are questions that I never thought I would ask myself, and now I almost need to know the answers. So if anybody knows anything about professional curling, which is probably the one thing that I literally never thought that I would ask chat ever in my life, uh, but if you guys know about professional curling, let me know, because now I'm genuinely curious. What do we got? Three cent spirit heart? Don't mind if I do. Ace of clubs? Don't mind if I do. That battery charge, I might mind if I do here shortly uh, if this item is trash from our boss fight here. Although if you would appreciate like freaking giving me a tears upgrade again, that'd be beautiful. We can reroll it twice. And hopefully that means we get something uh, extra phenomenal. We also still have a 35% chance at a deal with the devil, which is totally doable. And we're not going to lose that 35% chance, but it's still only 35, so a lot can go wrong here in terms of probability. Come on. You did it. Oh, why did I take safety pin? I really didn't want that. Um, 
Reroll both. Oh, yeah, that's the good stuff right there. Okay. Uh, Ghost Baby, Brimstone. How does this work? Yup. Yup, that's how that works. The only problem is, uh, I'm now firing a shot about once every millennia. So, if you want to give me the greatest tiers upgrade on the planet, sign me up. Otherwise, um, I would prefer if we just, like, pretend that I'm really overpowered and that everything will be okay in the near future. Let's head down to the next floor. We got this stars card, which has value to it. Do you pop it now or no? I mean, we could become not Demon Man, but I kind of like Demon Man. Take me by the hand, make you understand. Okay, allow me through here. Thank you. Spikes come up, spikes go down, allow me through here. Thank you very much. Move on with your dear old golly G day. Beautiful. Uh, yep, that is the wrong direction to have fired that. Oh my god, dude. It takes so long <laughs> to fire this shot. Holy hell. How did that not kill you, though? It was right on top of you. Are right, we're actually going to be here forever, though. Where's the ghost? I fired it the wrong way. This guy is actually invincible, though. Okay. Are you dead yet? You're dead. Thank the freaking skies. Now, luckily, rooms like this, we're going to end up clearing enemies without even really knowing that we're clearing them. So there's benefit there. I mean, I definitely... I would rather have this scenario right now than what I had before. This leaves a lot of window of opportunity for the future to be very bright for us. However, we're still not really in a great spot. We're going to crack this. And then we're going to teleport out. Scatter bombs. We don't really need them. And lost butt or whatever that is, we really don't need. So if you want to give me some rerolls, uh, I would absolutely adore spending them in that room because that item is bad uh, is the whole moral of the story but sure we can continue on this electric word life it doesn't mean forever right now um sure we'll fight the boss headless horseman you're gonna give me the pony aren't you i really don't want the pony right now though all right do you give a pony i don't know if you give the pony do you give the pony? You probably give the pony. I don't want the pony, though. You can leave it behind. It's okay. Good night. Yeah, you gave me the pony. Um, I want to reroll that, too, frankly. Uh, what is better, though? Smart fly or pony? The answer is smart fly. So we reroll the pony first, and then hope for uh, another op- I mean, we do have a reroll back in- the Oh, we have one here, too. Okay, we're gonna- Go reroll the pony first. Pray for torn photo or something like that. Cracker Jacks. I find it hard to believe that I want that right now. I know that that's very picky because it gives a trinket. That trinket could be good. But I'm a picky soul. We're also moving at a snail's pace. A speed upgrade would be great. Magic Mush would be great. Um, But that's a little asking much. <sighs> HP plus luck? Nobody wants that. We do have a battery charge back there. There is one in here as well. Um, we can't really get it, though. I would love Mom's key as well. Let's bomb this guy. 7 cent car battery. Does actually nothing for us, so never mind. I feel like we have to almost continue doing this floor... Uh, as much as I know we're moving slow, I mean, we're not moving slow, but we're not moving fast. Uh, I need to milk our opportunities if I want to win this run. It's literally, this is a precarious one. Because on the womb and beyond, freaking Buzz Lightyear style, uh, we could end up in a really bad spot on this one. Uh, if we take too much damage here. So, I want to play smart, which is something that I don't ever normally do. Uh, but I want to play smart, and I want to make sure that we're getting all benefit out of this floor as we can. Uh, and that means basically trying to get as much money as we can at this point. Because our shop has some valuable stuff in it that we desire. Bad hit right there, but life goes on as I'm fading away. It's not really the greatest use of that one, but 
nonetheless, it's okay. If we can just get some consumables, I would love to use this Ace of Clubs uh, and turn it into some bombs for us. I mean, I can't deny I really want those battery charges too. And turning those into bombs won't do much. Okay, um, go this way. I hate this room with a passion, but it worked out pretty okay in my favor. There's one bomb. Okay. We can make some magic happen with that. I just don't know how I want to use it yet. Because there was a tinted rock, correct? There's value in a tinted rock. There is a troll bomb there. Um, the value the tinted rock has is in coming in here. Yeah, I honestly think you use the Tinted Rock here to try and get these Skulls too. I mean, just one Spirit Heart's not the best, but it's still better than nothing. Let's go down and reroll. I think the boss item is still the most important thing for us to reroll here. Because if it gives us just any good stat upgrade, we're running out of bad items for it to give us. Like, we've gotten most of the bad items. So, give me something fantastic. God, it's really good, and we have a syringe, and it's a speed upgrade. I, I can't not take that there. So please forgive me for what I've done, but that is the right move. At least I believe it is. We are going to continue to go back, though, because we have another battery charge. Uh, we still have the item room. Boss Rush Dreams went right out the window, and you can freaking thank uh, Water Balloon's charge time for that one. Basically, you can thank me not getting the deals with the devil uh, at the beginning of this run for that one. It's not Water Balloon's fault. He's been doing his due diligence here. It's the fact that we got we got two battery charges here. It's the fact that we got uh, Mr. I'm Slow as Molasses as our character. Uh, combined with Mr. Takes Damage all the time. Both of which are a bad combo, mind you. Come in here. Uh, Rerolled this into Game Pack is not good. But, okay, yeah, no, the, whatever I was about to try wasn't actually going to work. Let's re-roll that into a bomb. Uh, we can use this bomb to get something that I haven't determined yet. We could use it to get those battery charges, maybe, but we're not going to do that yet. We still got a battery charge in here, right? Yes, sir. -y. Thank you. There's a closet right here. I think these are worth checking. I mean, Sloth, he gave us the moon card. There's benefit to that, frankly. We haven't found our secret room. So maybe we pop it, um, but I don't necessarily think that's a great idea. I'd rather save it for the next floor and get out of a boss trap or mob trap room or something. Come on, Papa needs a new pair of shoes right now. Yeah, it's good enough. I can accept that. Uh, secret room or super secret room? I'll bite the bullet and go super secret room, despite them usually being significantly worse. Um, and... This contains an eternal heart, little extra HP, it never hurt anybody. Let's head down to the next floor. Finally, everybody freaking rejoices in the comments. They're like, Tyler, you spent 19 years on that floor. What's going on, man? You've lost your juju. I didn't lose no juju. You lost your juju. We're going to go this way. Why are we going this way? Uh, I don't know, mainly because of the item room, but... We could have gone to the shop first. Although, we don't have money, so I suppose that's why we went this way. If we can just land a couple of these balloons in the right spots, we're going to be fine. One more. Uh, one more. There we go. I will go back up. You feeling down? I'm not feeling down anymore. A bomb would be splendid. We have tinted rocks all over. We got other stuff that I would just like to bomb. We got holy water. Um, I don't really want holy water. I think that's relatively straightforward here. I appreciate the money, but also I would appreciate it if you stopped. I'm just going to come in here now. Uh, I am going to pay you almost all of my keys, I think. Is this intelligent? No. Unless he gives us... Ma Infamy's good, but come on, man. We don't need infamy right now. We need damage and tears and stuff of that nature. I appreciate the bomb. Small rock would be honestly huge. It's a damage and tears upgrade. So if you want to make it happen right now, game, make it happen. Instead, you give me a spirit heart that I got hurt more going for than I think what I had. 
There's not much we can do here, honestly. I think you just go make it to the arcade, I guess, and then hope that there's a blood machine in there. Utilize the blood machine. You just totally blocked my uh, bomb bullet water balloon. That's the word I wanted. Uh, but hope there's a blood machine in there that we can then play to use up all of our red hearts right now. Get some money for it. There's two of these pills now. Pretty fly. We should go back and pick up the other one then. But I would love to get some value out of the shop. Uh, it's just a matter of actually getting to it. There is a blood machine. We'll play this thing a little bit, at least enough to, uh, I mean, sure, we will now play this twice, and then make that three times, and then make that four times, and honestly, we're creating a never-ending cycle right now, which it's hard for me to be mad about. Uh, we actually are just going to generate infinite money at this point. You know what? I actually think this is worth it to spend a little bit more. Let's reroll that into Crack the Freaking Sky. You gotta be kidding me. What is up with, like, only spacebar items on this run? It's just bad passives and spacebar items. I'm not overly content with that. Uh, I suppose you go to the shop. I think that's straightforward here. I also want to go to this boss trap room. You know, if there's golden chests or something, maybe worth, but maybe not three red chests would be worth. That could even be worth, but I still find it hard to believe that I want to fight several bosses for two chests that could literally pop out half red hearts each. Thanks for dying there. Let's go up to our shop. I know that this is maybe a little bit boring today, but we need... Sometimes you got these runs. Everybody has those days, and we need to just fix our day, is all. There, there's... Our truck has broken down on the side of the road, but it's in the repair shop right now, okay? We're guaranteed to not get greed in this shop, which I think is very, very important to our success. You're going to see. All we need is one or two good items in here. This could do it. It actually did it. That is an incredible pickup. Um, And actually, it's so incredible that it might actually be worth keeping mom's box just to have the doubled stat effect of it. So thank you very much, game, for seeing me through here and giving me a great synergy. It pains me a lot to see the D6 go because everybody wants the D6. But we're making it happen in a different way. And I think that this is uh, a valuable thing for us here we're firing shots so much faster like this is this is the right play right here i stand by that uh, and i will stand by that for as long as i live we did get a deal as well that deal is three red chests that contain jack all dude for as good as that last run was with chronos even though we died because i tried to be really dumb and play fast um we have super like paid for it on this one the rng gods were like yeah you want a good run on that one eat crap on this one and people are probably like "Ooh, tyler's complaining about having brimstone look i have brimstone and i have still a 49 tier stat even though like i did basically double what i had before and by double, I mean it's half of what I had before, but you get the gist here. I don't even know if I get another item, if it's w another trinket, if it's ever worth it to get rid of what I have right now. This might actually be the best item for us. I will pick this up. Uh, it, it's bombs, frankly, at this point. Uh, we'll throw that down right there. Thanks for your time. I and mean, Blackheart's valuable. Any HP at this point is valuable. I mean... I honestly, like, I'm more... Before, I really was not concerned about dying on this run. Now I'm, like, actually looking at our HP and I'm like, mm, I could bite the dust on this one for sure. It's not exactly unheard of. Thank you, game, for being like that. It's not unheard of for me to crap the bet on a run like this. Uh, and I think that while I don't want it to happen, I just want to brace you guys for when it does. 
And don't even tell me that, ooh, he had, you know, Brimstone and he lost. Tyler sucks. Are you looking at the tier stat, though? This thing's a little uncontrollable occasionally. I, it's basically like firing out a Monstro's Lung Brimstone, except we can't even point one of the brims in a direction. It's a tough run, man. You, you can't fault me for anything right now we don't need money if we get money equals power later then you know what just screw me um but we don't need it right now thank you for your time i will pop this maggie's faith i mean it gives us hp but honestly that's one thing that we're not super in need of you know more i, I suppose red hp we're not in need of i don't really want to be carrying more red hp than what we got right now what is in here? A pill? Please be like a damage up pill. I know that those aren't even in the game, but I would love to have it right now. We're doing a significantly better ever since picking up Crack Crown, and I think that that's pretty straightforward as to why. Uh, it is a damage upgrade that is then, or uh, all stats upgrade that is then getting doubled by, and those goblins are really good, but uh, it's then getting doubled, speed down is horrible, by uh, Mom's Box. But it's also just, yeah, okay, um, well, crack all these. Vibrant Bulb is really good, but is it a better stat upgrade than Cracked Crown if we have a full charge? We are going to experiment. This, is, this could be a turning point of the run, in all honesty, if we figure this out. Because I don't know the difference, really. And what's the point in popping mom's box if you have your ideal trinket? So we can keep it at a full charge forever. That's not going to bother me in the slightest. So let's go back up here. Uh, I don't mind clearing a couple rooms doing this. I probably should have picked up the other one for now. But it's going to be fine. Uh, that's actually some BS. But I'm not going to say a word about it. Because I, I was at fault. It's my own fault. It's still just some BS. I hit the button before cool one more room then we get a charge and we see what is the better all stats pickup it's a minus seven okay well that's a pretty easy <laughs> thing to realize here we're gonna go pick up the other guy and we'll just see what changes in terms of stats down uh, and i feel like it is a significant difference so take this it's a luck down. Other than that, it's a plus in everything else. So this is definitely what we want. Uh, fight Loki here. Thanks a ton. You're doing a fine job. Give me a tears upgrade. It's not good. Uh, it could be worse, but it's not good. The sun. Very good for the next floor. Uh, we will actually be able to do hush. Should I do hush? I mean, we might not be able to do Hush, but should I do Hush if given the opportunity? I think the best answer to that question is absolutely not. Which means that if this door opens, I'm going to go down it. And it's open. God damn it. Uh, this, I'm going to let you know right now. This is where the run's going to end. And this is the worst idea I've ever had. But we're still going to do it. Blood Bag is okay. I mean, in the very least, it's a speed upgrade, which is really nice. <laughs> These are both horrible. Uh, we will take milk, though, because when we get hit in this fight, we'll be able to get a tears upgrade from it. In here, we get... <laughs> How bad have the items been on this run? For the love of all that is holy. I suppose you take sissy long legs. And then in here, you take starter deck. Which gives you a judgment, which you blow up. You can't even blow it up. Good job, Tyler. Uh, do you even take Bogo Bombs? Don't think so. Can we get this guy to uh, pay out with anything of value? Find out next week on Hell Breakfast. It's at least HP. Hard for me to be pissed. Let's do this. This is going to go really bad, I think. Honestly, just hit me. Thank you. It's a minus four. Okay. Well, it was nice knowing you guys. This is going to be a long fight, frankly. It's not going to be enjoyable in the slightest. It's going to be very long. Uh, it's going to be very painful. And I'm going to be sad. 
Maybe it won't be. I mean, is it going to put in enough work to have it be good? I suppose this won't take forever, but we could still easily die during it, is what I'll say. I do enjoy the green brim laser, though, because of common cold. Seems like actually ages ago we picked up common cold on this run, but that is damn near besides the point. The fact of the matter is we have it now, and it's doing work for us now. We also have a red heart on the ground. No idea how we actually got that, but I'm accepting of it. Thank you for your time. I mean, we do have the virus. Can we create black hearts, please? Why are we creating red hearts? I don't really want to create red hearts. Don't we have the virus? We do have the virus. Shouldn't they be dropping black hearts for me? Because I would prefer that. I know that that's only if I slam into them, but I did slam into them and they created red hearts instead. Life is very confusing, isn't it? We're halfway through this fight somehow. I actually have no idea how. Um, I also have no idea how he Mandel. Did anybody watch Deal or No Deal back in the day? I feel like every family watched Deal or No Deal back in the day. People were just obsessed with watching a game show devoted to absolute pure luck and greed. Because it was like, oh, we'll give you $999,000. There's a chance that there's going to be a million in that case, but there's a chance you're going to walk out of here with six pennies. And they're like, mmm, I really want that extra thousand. It's like, okay, he's stupid. You know, how many times did that happen? Literally every single episode. Like, how about this? Oh, take the money and run. Listen to the Eagles. Occasionally, they have good advice for you. At that point, if you're being offered damn near close to what you had before, just take it, man. Money's money. You got freely chosen to be on this game show. Just take the money and run. Okay, please, though, stop with this right now. And I would appreciate it if all you would get out of here, too. Uh, not the people watching. You guys are splendid. Talking about these weird blue men. Which is not to be confused with blue man group. Okay, you're almost dead, Hush. Just bite the dust, and it'll be a happy good time. You went back down. I don't appreciate that. Die? Oh my god, please. Pop back up. We will survive the Hush fight. Much to my own surprise. Uh, and that means that we'll just have enough time to botch it on the cathedral. Uh, we might not survive. I'm actually a wizard right now. How in the hell did I get out of most of that alive? One heart. One heart this time. Bam, bam. Two hearts this time. Is there a heart in here? There is a heart in here. I will take that. Um. Yeah, sure. Let's head up to the cathedral. Am I feeling good about this? Not at all. And you know what that means? It means we'll probably win this run, because that's just how my life is. Uh, come down here. It's the bloat. There ain't nobody like the bloat. You're probably wondering, Tyler, when are you going to pop this sun card? I'm going to wait for a room that has normal enemies, like this one. Peace out. Also, peace up A-Town. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. Chickity chickity bang. Okay. Go this way. I'm sorry I'm losing it. I'm a little punch drunk. It's like the sixth video today. Uh, it's a lot of videos for those that don't do the recording business. I'm tired. It's 9.04 at night. I have a long day ahead of me tomorrow. Solid like 12 hours in a car. It's never been more enjoyable in my life. We're actually going to survive this damn run. I hate every second of it, uh, but I also love every second of it. I'm hoping we get some fun synergies on the chest. I'll probably end up spawning in some items on the chest. Uh, just because if I made it this far, uh, I deserve to try out some fun synergies. Water Balloon, that's the whole point of this uh, series here. So you guys won't mind if I throw in like a random technology in here and see what that does. Uh, a random Ipecac in here. See what that does. I know there's a lot of synergies with this bad boy. And I want to try them all. So. We will do that momentarily. We just got to get through this damn Isaac fight. Uh, which will be over. Within the next like. Two balloons. I, I should have just stood still. Frankly. Isaac. You've met your match. 
Good night, my dear sweet angel, and let me head down to the next floor. We do have enough keys to open all of our chests, which is good, uh, but we're going to be spawning uh, items anyway, so YOLO. Book of Rev, it's good. Robo Baby, eh, Wafer, great. Black Hole, okay. Book of Rev, I will take you, and then I will Mom's Box. Okay, let's spawn some items. Uh, let's try technology. I'm curious about this. Does nothing. Let's remove brimstone. Yeah, okay. It does it does a technology shot. I can get pretty down with that, in all honesty. Let's try remove technology. Give item mom's knife. Mom's knife does nothing. Okay. Like per use. Uh remove mom's knife. Let's give item Ipecac. Now I'm concerned. Yup, bad idea, let's do it. This is the stupidest idea I've had, uh, and I love every second of it. D10 is not good. Yeah, this is like a disaster and a half in here, isn't it? So, Ipecac uh, Water Balloon, this is exactly how you would expect it to be. I do want to try to remove Ipecac, and I would like to try Cricket's Body. Yeah, no, this is the good stuff right here. I, I like this a fair bit. Just have tears all over the screen. I can get down with that. Uh, I want to try Ludo as well. Just because it's Ludo. And if I can control a floating water balloon, I would love that. I literally control a floating water balloon. It doesn't really do anything besides just be a big water balloon. But there's a part of me that just loves that even more. Yeah, no, it, it, this works for me, honestly. It does like zero damage, but I, I can get down with this. Let's give item... I don't know, what, what's a fun item to try? My reflection, why not? Okay, well this just makes us have a really high... Uh, <laughs> really high shot speed? Remove Ludo. Remove Ludo. Get it out of there. Uh, yeah. Now I'm fire. This is a good synergy. Honestly. Just fire water balloons that go all over. Fine by me. We'll keep this and we'll finish up like this. Uh, a lot of people may be pissed that I spawned in items at the end. But, like, is, are you going to lose sleep over it? If you're going to lose sleep over it, I won't do it anymore. But you're probably not going to lose sleep over it. You're probably going to finish watching the video and be like, Well, that was indeed a video. And then you're going to forget about it 10 seconds later. So, just allow me to finish up this damn run. See a war. What is it good for? Absolutely fruitly nothing. And then let me go fight this uh, blue baby monster right here. Thank you for your time. Don't do the crime. We could still die here, actually. I'm not going to put it past myself. We do have the wafer, which means that our chances of dying are much less. But I literally, like, don't even know what tiers are mine and which ones aren't. Which is problematic on a run like this. So, I'm just going to fire them in that direction and then hope that nothing hits me. I can kind of see which ones are his, but, like, really not at all. That's going to do it, though. If you guys enjoyed, we're not going to freaking, uh, void. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, uh, subscribe if you enjoyed the content. Go check out the mod in the description down below. Have a good day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.